a hidden sign. A hidden symbol. A symbol. Now I have all the clues to help me find where these symbols are leading. All I need is imagination. The signs are pointing to this bust. What is this place? I am unsure, Watson, but everything points to the fact that it was the last place visited by Sir Rodney Bentcliffe. We are approaching the end of this mystery. A broken glass plate. What is it doing here? I should examine it at Baker Street. <coughs> How very peculiar. An ice maker. Why would Sir Rodney have brought such a device here? A sack of crude salt. Mithras, the god clothed in Anatolian costume and wearing a Phrygian cap killing the bull. This fresco resembles either a ladder or a hierarchy. The fire casts a shadow upon the floor. The pillar collapsed a long time ago.
It resembles a bull. That is the symbol of Neptune, the god of the sea. It is very similar to the face of Mithras. This shadow seems to represent a bridge. The shadows show us the way to go. We will find Mithras after Neptune, the bull, and the bridge. We cannot go any further. Mummified bodies. We are in some type of catacomb. Mummified bodies. We are in some type of catacomb. Mummified bodies. Mummified. Mummified. It is a statue of Minerva. We should use these metal rings to help us reach the bridge pillar. We should use these metal... I should use the appropriate object here. 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 We should use these metal rings to help us reach the bridge pillar. The gastrofets were used with ropes and hooks for sieges.
Done. Watson, could you please use this negative and your photographic equipment to process the photograph? Thank you, Watson. Now I must use reagents to develop the photograph. The Pyramids of Giza in Egypt. Sir Rodney. Another archaeologist, most probably. Salt. Ice. Ice cream in the desert. We are indebted to the Romans who developed the technique. Ice cream. So that's it. Salt and crushed ice may help to create ice cream. My archive. I can always consult with it if needed. If I wish to shape the ice knife, then I need to pour water inside the mold. Ice, salt, and then the mixing. It should be elementary. We need to reach minus 20 degrees Celsius to fully freeze the water inside the mold. Before beginning, I must remember that I have enough ice and salt for no more than four attempts. I think that ice should be added first. A block of ice. I have only to use my ice pick. Oh, look. The temperature is reducing. A block of ice. I have only to use my ice pick. Ice, salt, and then the mixing. It should be elementary. We need to reach minus 20 degrees Celsius to fully freeze the water inside the mold. It's empty. Ice, salt, and then the mixing. It should be elementary. We need to reach minus 20 degrees Celsius to fully freeze the water inside the mold. Before beginning, I must remember that I have enough ice and salt for no more than four attempts. Oh, look. The temperature is...
Excellent. Now we must check to ensure that it is adequately frozen. An ice weapon for a cold-blooded murder. An ice knife. A surprising and yet a very brilliant idea. It's the perfect weapon. It enables one to kill a man and then it melts. The only trace it leaves is a small puddle on the ground. Please escort this suspect for interrogation. The paintings in the baths are focused on Mithras, I understand. Yes, they are what make this place remarkable. And that is why Sir Rodney came here? He believed that the golden knife, which is an ancient ritual item, was hidden somewhere around the baths. I admit that it would be wonderful if it were true. And you are not concerned by the reputation of this artifact? You mean the curse? Before someone is dead, it is a blessing. After they are dead, well, then it becomes a curse. <laughs> Please escort this suspect for interrogation. What can you tell me about Mithras? Oh, so much. It was the core of our work. Why do you ask? Were you seeking the golden knife? Ah, I see you are an amateur. Yes, the golden knife was our grail. It is said that it bears the only text explaining the ritual of the cult of Mithras. I understand. I read something about immortality. A myth. Uh, the knife would provide immortality only to the worthy one. And yet it is cursed, and it would kill you if you were not initiated. Did you expect to find the golden knife at the baths? Well, Sir Rodney thought that it might be there. Uh, did you observe the knife representations there? They are so extraordinary, uh, and we had hoped that... Uh, oh, it is a tragedy that he has passed away, taking all of his secrets with him. As soon as I've been released, I will continue Sir Rodney's researches in his memory. Please escort this suspect for interrogation. Perhaps you could explain the cult of Mithras to me. No, there is nothing to say. We, we, we are not the worthy ones. But Sir Rodney believed that he was? He was wrong. I, I have visions. The golden knife, the, the mummy. Oh, it's all my fault. Calm down, Mr. Garrow. 